James Thompson Jr. appeared before a Hall County judge, facing 11 felony charges connected to the deadly rest area stabbing. Thompson is charged with first degree murder, attempted murder, and use of a deadly weapon to commit a felony, among other charges. He's accused of stabbing a Missouri couple, Gary and Mary Weaver, Wednesday morning. According to court documents, video from the dash cam of a nearby semi trailer shows the suspect, Thompson, going inside the Weaver's RV, where authorities would later find Gary bleeding from his chest and head. He would die from his injuries, and the affidavit says the video shows the suspect later outside the RV stabbing Mary in the side of the head. At last check, Mary was in stable condition, and when asked in court this morning if Thompson wanted someone to represent him, he initially said no. Judge Wetzel advised that he should have someone and eventually appointed him a public defender. The judge denied bond in this case, with his next hearing set for July 9th. But for friends and family, this tragedy has shaken them. They were two of the sweetest, gentlest souls you'd ever want to meet. I mean, if nobody deserves this, but if anybody didn't deserve it, it was certainly them. The Weaver's daughter says the couple had been together for 46 years, adding, quote, the only thing that could help is it's hard seeing reporting that doesn't include what an incredible person and father my dad was. He was a well-known musician in the 70s, playing with the Walter Scott Band and a longtime pianist for the Third Baptist Church. For example, not to mention what an incredible father and grandpa he was.